All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another awesome and amazing episode. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Episode two, right where we left off, right at the, I, I can't talk, I can't talk. We gotta get into the action. We have to get into the action. I can't I can't waste any time. Hopefully I can jump over this, right? There's no dog anywhere over here, right? Okay, I, I think we're good. I, that guy just spawned. Little doggy cage just spawned. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We're gonna start the quest. We can't waste any time here. No zombies up in here. We do got a box though. I do like the box. It looks like we're supposed to go up there to get inside of the house, maybe? Assuming, maybe? Let's, let's just do it. I, I can't waste any time. The more time I waste, the more danger I'm in because of the zombies and everything like that. So hopefully there's something actually up here that's not a dead zombie. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a bird. I got this. Get out my face. Can I make that jump? I can make that jump, right? Let's go. That's a massive W. Let's go. Can I get in here? See, see, I'm fast with it, bro. I'm smart with it. Right to the ceiling. That's a lock. So yeah, we're definitely supposed to go up here. Definitely gonna be a few zombies up here for sure. They can't hide them from me, bro. They can't hide them from me. Oh, okay. Okay, that just scared me. So many of them, bro, so many. I gotta, I gotta watch out. Anytime you see like the crates and everything, that's just a, where are you going? Are you climbing over each other? That's just like an automatic sign that, hey, hey. Oh, I got no energy. Oh, we're okay, we're good, we're fine. Don't, I don't wanna get infected again. I do not wanna get infected. This needs repairing, that's what it was. I was trying to hit, I was like, bro, it wouldn't let me hit. We got it now, we're good, everything's good. It's just three of them, but, uh, oh, we gotta go down there too. Everything seems to be locked, but I think this is the money room right here, okay? We are definitely inside of the money room, and I'm hoping, hope something just broke. Something just broke. I'm, I'm I'm hoping that they won't break down anything and I'll be I'll be straight got some good loot right there Pretty solid y'all good someone's out there for sure. Give me some of this. Give me some food. Here we go This is what we want. We also want this cooking pot. That's that's very important. Definitely need to cut we're encumbered That is not good. That is definitely not good. Can I get something nothing bro? Come on. What time is it? Uh, it's almost 20. It's almost 20. We got a little bit till it's 20. I gotta I gotta get down here I gotta get down here. This is the last place that we gotta we gotta check. This might be the outside, actually. We might be done. I think we're completely done. Yeah, we gotta talk to the trading now. That's definitely outside. Let's get out of here. We gotta go home. Bro, I'm so scared. I have 20 minutes. This is my only way out. <laughs> I, I was gonna be smart about this, okay? I know if I jump down there, my legs are broken. But look at me. I'm smart with it. That's not gonna break my legs, right? We're fine. We're fine. Mission accomplished. Let's get out of here and let's not run into another dog. I completely forgot where my house is. Okay, we gotta go on the other side of the map. We got 15 minutes. We can make this. Okay, we can make this. We 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 can definitely run, you know, we got this for sure. 100 percent Okay, so it's it's 20. And um I might have been wrong. Maybe oh game. Okay. Maybe um maybe zombies don't run at 20. Maybe it's 22. It might be 22. Because nothing's running after me right now, so yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna assume that it's 22 and it's not 20. So that means we got a little bit of time to talk to the trader, right? Trader, trader droll, you're here, right? Your door's not closed, right? My man, my man. Look, man, I done did your quest and I'm gonna need a good reward, okay? Oh crap, I thought, did I close that? Like, did I, did I, did I, did I, I I'm gonna need something good here. Ah, uh, batter up value. Actually, using this dirty trick to win desp uh, desperate situations, power attacks to the legs, slow enemies. I could actually use this since I'm gonna be like, you know, using melee a lot. And I don't have a shotgun anyway, so like, why get the shotgun, you feel me? So yeah, I, I could definitely use that. Let's get the shortest one, just because it's, it's just smarter. All right, we can go ahead and use that. Thank you very much. We got an armor pocket, that's a W. I'm going to use this one, I guess. I mean, run speed, I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, let's just scrap that one. We'll keep one of them for the run speed, for sure. Um, I think that's it, it's time to go home. It's time to go home and, and I don't have to talk to you. Let's, let's see what he has first. You got anything to stash? I When it comes to the traders, I really don't know what's good and what's bad. You know, I really don't know. I know mini bike handlebars might be good just for mini bike situations or whatnot. But like other than that, I really have no idea of... Oh, a raw... Oh, I know that's good. I know a robotic sledge is good, but it's 10,000. I definitely don't have that. I definitely don't have it. If, if anyone... 
if any of you guys know what's good and what's bad or what I should be doing, please let me know. I'd, I'd love it. I'd love it. Okay, it is now nighttime. I did a little bit of a harvesting. I came to my base. I put all my stuff away. Did a little bit of harvesting for some wood and some stone. Upgraded my axe. Did the nice little jazz. And for our first night of seven days of die, all we're going to do is be upgrading our base. That is the main thing that I want to worry about right now is completely just reinforcing the base, making sure that we have our areas covered because I know we're going to get some zombies. You, you look at this. It's a whole broken window. We got work to do okay we have some work to do all right ladies and gentlemen it is now four o'clock in the morning it is time for us to get started with our day um the things that i did done is i kind of is sorted out my chest i got my like resources here this is just a bunch of random stuff that i threw together up in here so i'm just about to continue to just throw random stuff up in there and then i got my uh, like little ammo or whatnot in there and i also secured the base a little bit got me some hatches in my main like little doorway for my main part of the base uh i closed off this area of the base right here because it there was like two entrances back there where zombies could get in i was like i don't really like that so i just closed it off uh put some hatches here just in case they do come this way i can always you know have this as like a little bit of a defense um and right here also closes off because that was a little back area right there where they could get in so i just closed that completely off i don't want any type of access there so i only have really two entry points for zombies which is right here the front door um, and I also have this right here, which I could have closed this off, but eh, I don't know. Having two entry points really isn't, you know, in, in my opinion, isn't that bad. And if all, you know, all the shit hits the fan, then I can always just come back here and we're, we're pretty much good. I should maybe make a little bit of an escape route here, put like some ladders going up into the roof here, just in case, you know, they get here and then I have to run or whatnot. But we'll, we'll think about that later. Um, right now, we just need to focus on this trader, need to focus on gathering some resources. I really need wood, like a lot, really low on wood. So that's another thing I'm going to focus on. But the first thing that we're doing this morning, morning is doing the quest that's the first thing i want to try to knock out two quests today just like we did yesterday i want to try to knock out two quests now this is a clear quest and it's four o'clock in the morning so we're going to double rate this house of course um head back and hopefully we have enough time to do another one and hopefully we can let some wood on the way so let's go ahead and get that started all right we're pretty much here i'm trying to scope out the area a little bit i believe we have to go up here and then uh maybe no that's the garage oh we have to we definitely have to enter from here okay so um should we do the garage first i mean we're already right here let's go ahead and knock this garage out first and foremost we got a workbench oh a workbench schematic would have been crazy right there or even like a uh, little one of those blender cement mixer that's i said blender a little cement mixer right there would have been crazy that door is locked that wasn't that was really anticlimactic. i was expecting to get a little bit more out of that but we're not in the main house so i need to get me a shovel so i can collect cement while i'm here as well um i believe i could just oh oh no where they at right here take him down take him down no energy no energy okay it's okay she's walking she's walking we're fine we're fine i can use my bolt okay that was that was definitely a fail you're dead get out of my face thank you very much go back down you're dead thank you and big hits big hits see bro i got this i got this in back i was not expecting to just drop down like that i was that was crazy hopefully um this place looks mad empty looks like no furniture look no chairs just a there's a whole table on the freaking on the on the inside of the, look this place is this is the most least decorated house i've seen honestly oh man i went i went behind a bookshelf here look at that bro ladder straight to the you already know there's something up here. oh boy oh boy let me sneak let me check my surroundings you go straight to the roof and you see that you already know this is the mother load room this is the room bro this is the, the this is the room with the see what i tell you this is the room with a bunch of zombies man that's one of them. There's got to be more. There's got to be something behind that, man. There might honestly be more up there. Like, I can't really see up there, though. If there is, I'm pretty sure I can handle it. But one zombie and this... there's There's got to be more, right? No way there's just only one singular zombie. There's nothing behind here? Okay, I... I, I guess I guess there's just one singular zombie trying to protect this entire area. Can I get something good here though? That's the that's the real main question. I don't think there's anything. Yeah, there's nothing over there. So we just got these two boxes. Some you know ammo. Oh, okay. A flashlight is actually kind of nice. I don't have a weapon per se, but uh, got me a new bow. So that's a that's kind of a dub right there. Go ahead and eat this. Go ahead and eat this as well, cause why not? Now it's just time for the main course. Now it's time for the main course. Come on, shipping container, shipping crane. Come on, give me give me some armor. Maybe a pipe pistol or a pipe machine gun, pipe rifle. Uh, I mean, a leather duster. Nah, I'm gonna keep my run speed. I guess is 
eh, it's okay you know i guess like when we go to the snow biome it'll come in handy because we can't be cold while we're in snow biome right so i mean i guess it'll come in in some type of handiness later down the line okay i believe i've pretty much just completely looted the entire house I, I i i think so so we're just gonna activate this now we already know where the loot's going to be it's gonna be all the way at the top i'm not even gonna bother with the garage because the last time i looted the garage it was just bad this is a trap right here right so we gotta go this way boom just like that we can't go through that door because it's locked obviously so which means we have to repair our axe first and farm i am we don't have any stone this might be bad i mean we do have a sledgehammer worst case scenario we have a sledgehammer but we basically just gotta clear out this area real fast and once that is complete and we kill her the secret door die should be right there which is pretty easy and the only thing we have to do is um clear all the zombies in this area so we don't have to like collect like a, a little pouch or anything like that my axe is pretty much done right after i completely destroyed his bookcase i'm pretty sure yep not even not even at least we got a sledgehammer i wish we had some type of stone though we have literally no stone to repair this guy um there's gonna be a zombie up there on the roof we already know that there might be some stone in these chests for us as well that would be clutch there's a zombie go ahead and miss the the shot completely i thought you know bullet drop arrow drop whatever kill him and that should be the only zombie here i'm pretty sure yeah so let's see what we get now so we got some bullets okay we'll take the bullets we got some food very nice the crate we got okay um i'm not gonna eat this i'll eat you i don't really mess with the brass knuckles all that much don't really need you put you there um i don't want to eat this stew because you know i'm not like super low on food or anything like that what is this the hunter's volume the, these desert dwellers do 10 percent more against the coyotes i mean it's not bad to have right 10 percent more against coyotes is never a bad thing this might take forever to break though oh maybe not maybe not we might have this one more hit two more one more and you're gone give me something good give me something good a f another a helmet light honestly a helmet light mod might not be bad it might not be bad if i'm being completely honest like i i don't i don't like having to carry around a torch you know everywhere i go so like having this uh helmet mod on me you know it's a little bit of convenience you know what i mean not bad at all not bad so now the only thing we got to do is pretty much just beat every single zombie i don't think any other location in this house really has any like good loot you know i think it's pretty much mediocre you know so i don't think i'm gonna focus on collecting loot much anymore since we already pretty much looted like the big bad base already you know what i mean like there's only what this downstairs portion which already didn't have anything so we're pretty much done we just gotta kill everything all right that was the last zombie now only thing we gotta do is maybe loot a little bit just a little bit you know drink some water drink some tea throw away the stuff that we definitely just do not need um and you know just just take a little bit left you know what i mean before we completely just skedat on out of here i i don't know where to loot but you know i saw a kitchen and i you know when you see a kitchen you're like food you know what i mean so i just collected whatever there was there and, and that's it now we're going back it's time to go back to the trader collect that quest get our reward and do another one guys i was just walking look okay two things happened i was walking i seen a blue car you know when you see a blue car you just gotta collect boom collect it boom level two pipe rifle now i'm just walking down the road and see i see a moose I see a moose. Look at him. Or a deer or whatever. You already know we got we got to put it in him. We got to we got to put it in him. We got to take him down. Right in the head. Right in the right in the fucking head. Right in the head. Right in the head. Oh buddy, we are eating good tonight, okay? We are eating good, huh? Look at that. Look no head. Where is it? It's gone. It's gone. Give it to me. Oh wait, I missed. I missed. There we go. There we go. Come on now let me have it ah look at that 30 meat nine freaking nine nine leather some some animal fat i need that animal fat for the torches too to light up the base and everything that was that was massive if i could find another one bro just the, the pure luck first the, first finding a rifle you know what i mean having ammo from the raid and then a moose right after that bro that's luck that is luck, man. You know, if it wasn't for that rifle, I wouldn't have been able to kill the deer. 100%, man. I didn't have a, I didn't have any arrows left. You know, bow and arrow probably wasn't going to kill in one shot like the rifle would have. You know what I mean? Like, it just W's after W's. You have already been looted. Now it's time to go to this trader. Now, trader, 
He's been giving me bull crap since the last two quests that I've been having with you, okay? I'm gonna need something better. I'm gonna need something better, Mr. Trader. I don't need no shotgun ammo. I'm not gonna use a shotgun. You know what I mean? Some rifle ammo would be nice, you know? Decent, you know? I don't really have like, you know, like a, a, a sword rifle or a pistol, but and we'll take it for the future, you know what I mean? But I, what I really need, I need a bike. And I know when you give it, you're not gonna give it to me this time, but okay we got the ammo now which one should we take though i'm thinking we take the seven two the seven two six two or seven seven six two i think if we take the seven six two i think that's the game plan you know what i mean like we already got the rifle the rifle takes the seven six two we don't have a pistol for the nine millimeter nine millimeter would be good if we did have a pistol because it's more but seven six two i think we're going to take the seven six two and call it a day now do you have any more jobs we got a fetch a uh, clear zombies 290 that's the one. Clear Zombies 290. Thank you very much, sure. I will definitely be doing that. First and foremost, though, we got to go back to the base so we can drop off our items. That is the most important thing that we have to do right now. All right, we dropped off our items inside of our base. Now it's time to skid out on out of here. I think after we double raid this place, because it's only 10 o'clock in the morning, you know what I mean? We still got 12 hours of sunlight. Um, that raid took us a whole, what, six hours, right? So we spent six hours here to be, what, 1,600? You know what I mean? We still got, well, like, like six hours or whatever six hours until the zombies start walking and we start dying so i think in that six hour period we're gonna farm up a bunch because we're still low like this is look at the wood and stone like we're still mad low on wood and we're still mad low on stone and i want to get more chests inside of our base organize it a little bit more you know do all that nice stuff before you know the raid happens and i want to start building my like base on day four in on day seven that's when i want to you know actually do the whole like seven days to die type deal i think this is the base that we have to raid here it looks like a one level one level like little thing it, it, definitely an underground part there's no way oh it's two levels okay maybe there's not an underground part first things first though is this door open it is now it is time to raid we have to i think this is a clear zombies it might not be oh, i should have made a shovel we have to make a shovel we we gotta make a shovel i can't make a shovel what do i need I need plant fibers. Okay, if we get some plant fibers making a shovel, I need to be farming these guys like 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 now. You know what I mean? You're just sitting here. Okay. We'll take that. Nice little heady. We'll take that. I like it. Hold up, bro. I think we just ran into a feral. I think we just ran into a feral. The way he was looking at me, is he feral? He is feral. I was about to say, the way this man was looking at me. You know, I closed the door right in this man's face, okay? I was terrified. I was like, no, nah, bro. You're a little bit too fast. Right in the head. Right in the chest, actually. I missed. But he, we should be fine. He's not going to break through this. Come on. Come on. How did you hit me? I'm on a whole block. But we killed him, though. It was, it was thankfully for that bullet. That one bullet that we took with us was enough to kill that man. That is crazy. We, we need more of them. Because there might be... I, I doubt there's more pharaohs in here. But we're definitely going to run into some more. Ooh! How did I get hit? I keep getting hit, bro. If I get infected, I'm gonna be furious. I'm okay. Okay, I understand. You're trying to, you're trying to fuck me up. I get it. I understand. There's a loot. One, one guard. You're not nothing to me, bro. Nothing to me. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. This is all mine. This is all mine. Oh, look at that. Exactly what we need. That is what we need. A level four. That is carrying us into late game. Not really late game, but that's carrying us into the first horde first horde day we're using that a level four pipe machine gun bro come on now it's a pipe machine gun and it's level four we have to use it bro only thing we need to do now is stock up on ammo it's a good thing we collected that 762 from the trader right then because now we got 762 for the pipe machine gun you feel me we're good we're goaded we got this now I'll be honest there's really nothing much we, we have left in this house like that's going to the outside i already did everything downstairs did everything in here i believe we've practically looted this entire place we gotta watch out for the pharaoh here because he's probably gonna spawn back once we actually activate this area but uh this is to the garage and then uh this is the way out so i mean i i believe we pretty much looted everything here i don't want to start the quest just yet because i still do want to get myself a shovel to loot all that because that is massively important um for our base and everything so I'm, I'm gonna give me some thatch i don't know why i call it thatch it's not me it's called what is this it is plant fibers what is where's thatch from i think that's from um i think it's from arc if you guys have ever played arc survival i think this that version of like the same type of thing but like it's like thatch or it's called thatch it's, i don't know i don't know references okay references but we got our shovel which is massive now we're gonna loot everything and we're gonna start that quest all right i think that was pretty much the only two little things that i want to loot in there I really don't even want this sledgehammer in my first slot anymore. Let's do that. Open this guy up. Go ahead and loot this again because why not? It's there and I need it. And now, now we shall kill everything. 
Get out of my face. If I had enough, if I had enough 762 ammo, I would definitely just use the gag on these guys. Like, like honestly, I, I don't have a reason not to. Like, I could really, can I just headshot this guy real quick and just, oh, wait, wait for it. Give me some time. Gotta reload, give me some time. And then, and then, there we go. I mean, like, I should just do that, really. Unless it just completely wakes up everyone. But like, they're not one shot headshot. Should I be conserving ammo at this point? I really don't know. You are annoying, so you're gonna get the gag. Yeah, you're definitely getting the gag. Um, the only thing you gotta watch out for is a pharaoh, which is I forgot where he oh he was in here. Yeah, he was in here. Oh, right, we're good. Nothing's in here. I think we're completely done already with this little bottom level. I guess I'll search this armor. Ah, uh, we're no no, no. I'm not putting that on. It's it, no protection, no nothing. You're outside, you're not getting in here. You're not very smart to <laughs> go the obvious route to get to me. Hopefully we get something here. I don't need bones. The coffee was nice. I'm probably gonna drink that now. Actually, where is it? Where, there we go. It sounded like he got a little bit closer. I got, I got a little scared there. We can always salvage that. Eh, nothing really. Actually, you know what? I'll take this. I'll take that. That comes in handy. Now it's just time for the upstairs part. Kill those zombies. Loot the looty loot loot. You scared me. Don't be walking up on me like that. Who do you think you are? Look at you. Falling. Oh! All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Where are you? Did he fall? He fell, didn't he? I, oh, I almost fell. I don't want to go back down there. Come on now. Come on now. There we go. See? See? All three bullets. All three of them. That's all we needed. Now we just got to take this guy out. Look at him. Look at him. Look, you just woke up. Look at you. He's gone. And that's it. Now we just got to talk back to the trader, bro. And we got a splint. That's actually kind of a W right there. I, I think that's the first splint I've seen like the entire the entire walkthrough so far That is the very first splint. We are look at our inventory. This is a problem. This is a problem We gotta we gotta get some rid of something. We have to get rid. I don't even know what to get rid of But we gotta get rid of something. What's in here? Give me something good a schematic Robot sledge. I don't even know how to make this thing I just know it's good and I'm happy. We don't even have to buy it from a trader anymore I was gonna buy it was like 10k, right? We don't even have to buy it from a trader anymore I could just learn that and we're good. We'll just make that we don't need coffee beans murky water Don't need you don't know what that oh, this is the coffee the black shot Does that give me any like special powers or anything like that? I think it does don't need the bone really um Probably can put these on yeah, cuz I don't have any boots already. So that's 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 pretty nice and I think that's pretty much it uh yeah our inventory should be you know decently better now right yeah that's good blueberries i guess i'll start eating you guys just because but it's time to skip that let's go ahead and collect you give me something 762 arrows i don't really have a crossbow crossbows are really good though if i ever find a crossbow i think i'd rather use that than a regular bro just because it's a lot stronger i've used a crossbow before only one time but that one time it was like a lot stronger give me something good here another spear hunter Hone your reflexes to perform a rapid spear thrust, increasing attack speed by 10%. Honestly, that is the third, the number three, third spear book I have collected. So I honestly might rock spears than clubs. Just, just a thought, just a thought. You know, I've never used spears before. Usually I just go straight club because it goes right into like pummel plead and, you know, harvesting things faster, stuff like that. It's just a lot more convenient and, you know, in, in my experiences, but honestly, rocking the spear might not be bad. It might not be bad. I am back, my friend, and I require the best of goods from your inventory. I need ammo. I need 7.62 ammo. Give me 7.62 ammo. Ugh. Pipe bomb ammo, and we got cooling mesh mod. Honestly, heat resistance, explosion resistance, and cold resistance. The heat resistance would be good for the desert for, like, the next up, you know, biome that I have to go to, but I've never actually been there yet, so I don't really know. I mean... I guess I could take that. I don't really use pipe bombs, you know, at all. You know what I mean? I feel like this is more like a super late game thing where you got like a bunch of zombies in one area and instead of like using a bunch of ammo, you just throw bombs at them. Like, I think that's like the only reason I would use pipe bombs and that's like mad late game. I feel like I would use the cooling mesh mod earlier than I would use the pipe bomb. So I'm gonna go with the cooling mesh mod just for now. Let me get another job. We're looking at I guess the fetch or the, the clear zombies would be good. I I, I think I'd rather go fetch, you know, because clear zombies, you got to kill everything. Fetch, you got to, you just got to get one thing. You know what I mean? So like, I feel like that might be just a little bit easier. I haven't looted this yet. Let me go ahead and do that. Some vitamins, kind of a W. I like that. I'll take the vitamins. Uh, I'll come back and loot everything else. Just come back. I, we're on a time crunch right now, okay? We, we're at 1400. We got to go back to the base, put everything up, and then we got to harvest and upgrade our base. That is the game plan, my friends. That is the game plan.
But before we can actually get into the game plan, you're gonna have to click on episode three, my friends. We're running a little bit too long. It's been like, what, 20 something, 25 minutes? So I don't want my episodes to be too long, my friends. So click on that next episode. And I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. Thank you very, very much. If you like the video, don't forget to actually like the video and I'll see you guys later. Peace.